Dr. Lai, what are your individual plans for your regime as general manager of the Metropolitan? I would say I would like to see that Met had two phases, a modern phase and the classic phase. And I also hope that the possibilities, and I don't think that we can do the modern phase inside the old theater, or not the old theater, but in the big Met. I think we need some smaller theater where we could make experimental opera and uh, modern things, and also commission operas, because if you, have a, if you commission an opera, it is a very, it's, it's a very expensive thing. And if it is a flop or it is not so, so successful, it doesn't matter if it is in a smaller house, but in a big house it is a disaster. And uh, I think it's necessary also to have modern things, because to get in contact with young people, you can also, we are going to have educational programs to try to poison them. The small kids from 8 to 40 years, special look-ins to get in, uh, uh, showing the magic of the theater, the, sea, the, the lighting, thunderstorms, and the parts of, of, of operas which uh, are, could uh, suit to the age. So they could understand that this program shouldn't be more than uh, one hour and a quarter, something like that. Well, your opera lovers are loyal people, and you have this educational program. But how do you plan to relate opera to the, the society of upheaval and protest that we live in? I think this with the experimental theater, that is one of the ways, because you can, so to say, make people, if they're coming in a smaller theater and seeing those modern operas and the uh, chamber operas which, which we reflect our time to, I think they will be curious to see what's also going to in the other house. And uh, I have seen also the public in there that they met. Uh, of course you talk about there are a lot of expensive seats, but they're also quite not so, so expensive for four dollars or five dollars. If, if you go to a movie, you, I think you pay three dollars. And you could see the Meister singer, for example, for three or four for four dollars, and you could go to a lousy movie, movie for three dollars. <laughs> so I think there are some possibilities anyhow to uh, to join. And I have a feeling when I see the the audience, there's a lot of young people at the moment. Well, do you expect changes in the form itself, say, in the next 20, 25 years? I hope to bring more. Uh, Every opera house, that is not a critic, but every opera has always had a cargo of very own productions. Uh, very, and that's every, everywhere. And you, I think you must try to brush up all those uh, and, uh, and giving it a, a new shape. As, as you can play Ibsen in a new frame and so on, you know, for example, the doll, the doll, the doll's house. This was an old um, uh, piece by Ibsen and that started more or less it was a reflection of the, the mo mo movement liberation, uh, the, the, the women liberation movement. Mm -hmm. And I think all the operas, you could, any, even an uh, opera like Rigoletto, for example, can be ex very exciting and, and, uh, and also have something to say our time. It depends completely how they are, uh, the, how they are directed. And well, do what do you feel about the houses themselves? The well, oh, there's sorry. a physical yeah. house. Uh, Met is a, has a very good equipment and, uh, and uh, a lot of things you could do there. But if you would ask me about the future of the opera house, and so I think most of the opera houses are already old-fashioned, more or less, in, the, in relation to composers and to, uh, and to directors and for the future, because you ought, I think, when you, in the future, when they're going to build new Houses, I think they must think about to make those houses complete and much more flexible. So the possibility to have an arena theater, at the same time building it for possibility to send, so to, 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 send uh, to, to, to use uh, television. So you could have closed circuits, people who could make a much larger distribu uh, distribution of those. Let me theater. ask you one last question. Hmm? What do you feel about the relation of local opera companies over this country to the Metropolitan? I think that's very good. As more opera, local opera, how companies you have as best it is because that means that you are preparing a new public and when we are coming it, we will be very happy to, to 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 have those and perhaps this will also i think it's a kind of circle you start you have a local and then i think it's as more opera companies you have more opera lovers you will have and the greater public you will have and as i said i think that's very good